Okay, my son has asked me to do this video just for him. Dad, how do you know if a girl likes you? Well, first off, I'm glad he said girls because I'm just glad. Listen, I, wanna, I don't know when a girl likes you because there's no way to know for sure. But here are some social cues that people tend to get to another person if they find them interesting or maybe even attractive. Number one, this, I'm just gonna, this is in general. The first thing is, if a person seems interested in you, I will tell my dear sweet son and my daughter too. In general, they're going to look at you a lot more. That is to say, they're going to people find someone attractive. Their eyeballs tend to want to look at them a whole lot. We do that all the time. This is common sense, but you can notice it very quickly when a person tends to stare at you. Now, this sounds exact opposite, but sometimes if they find you very attractive, they can look for a second, look away. It makes them so nervous to look at you. It's why people sometimes say in movies and TVs, I just I can't even look at you. You're so beautiful. There is a physiological response to that. Some people have a fear of really beautiful people it's called venus phobia and so if that happens they might be terrified of you that's a good sign high five if you get venus phobia but all that's a beautiful fear of beautiful women in particular uh, i think my son he might have that he's pretty scared of a lot of people Are you serious? in general if they give you good eye contact they stay right with you that's a sign that might find you pretty attractive if they found you unattractive they're gonna have a hard time looking at you unless they find you super attractive they might do this kind of, kind of look away like they'll look at you but they just seem real second thing is this do they seem extra nervous around you? Some girls are just nervous in general, that's for sure, no matter what. But you know some girl, if they're sticking with you, they're kind of keeping eye contact with you, they're staying with you, they're gonna do things to soothe themselves. Girls, you do this a lot. That is, when you're real nervous, you wanna soothe yourself, so you'll be real rocky, back and forth, you might bite your nails, a really common one is you pet yourself. So you stroke your hair, you pet yourself, you'll pet, 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 pet. It's like you pet little babies when they're sleepy, right? You just pat them on the back, but you're doing that to yourself. It's just, I'm nervous, I'm nervous, I'm nervous. That doesn't mean they find you attractive, they can be just feel nervous, they don't be awkward and so forth but in, ten, uh, in, in general that can be a sign that someone is finding you very attractive or they're interested in you the third thing is does the female and male too do they seem interested in wanting to talk to you more if they're like all right see you later don't care and never talk to you again there's your sign but if it's like they go okay there's some follow-up there's something about doing something together again those are your signs typically those three things this is in general it depends on the person well last thing i would say is and this is i've said to my son many many times that is the key is not to go to the opposite sex of course he's a heterosexual the opposite sex with a person and decide early on whether or not this is romantic or not i wouldn't think that at all i would think would i want to be friends with this person if you'll do that and not be all worked up about whether or not they think you're cute and this and that, whatever, you're gonna be far better off and healthy in life. Is that person friendly? Are they Christian? Of course, my son's a Christian. Are they Christian? Do we have similar values? That has to be the first one. I've done a lot of premarital counseling and all the ones that might be so gorgeous and so cute, whatever, it all fades. I mean, not for my wife. My wife is eternally beautiful all the time. That's right. But for other people, it can fade. And that's why you don't want to care about all the physical stuff all the time. But anyway, there's some signs. My son, when we do this, tell me your comments, subscribe more below and tell us girls, uh, if you're single, particularly my son is single, tell him what you would do to let him know that you're so interested in him. And what's it called? Your snap? I don't know what it's called. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it. I hope you learned something from it. If you don't mind, click subscribe, share this video with your friends, click like, and hey, write some comments down there. Let us know what you think about what I said. I also have a second channel, Dr. David Pendergrass Shorts. I'm also on TikTok. Check out my videos on TikTok. Follow me there and share with your friends. If you want to see content under 60 seconds, see you online.